In this video, we'll create a Amazon product image using Photoshop. Go to File, then Open, then open your product image, and go to File in New. So in Amazon, you need to have a at least 1,000 pixels of the canvas. So like you can put it here maybe one five pixels change this one to pixels then the height is one five also and the resolution is 72 and press ok so in your product image you should have you can right click this one on the title bar then go to image size so your image should be at least 1000 in size and also in height because we will change we will transfer this one to the to the canvas of Amazon Amazon standard image size so your image should be at least 1000 pixels or more so that it will be it will be not that pixelated or it's clear on the picture so right now we need to remove the gray area the gray background of this picture and we will transfer it here on the on the Amazon's uh, image size so click on the pen tool or on your keyboard is letter P just click this one then by holding control and space on your keyboard you can zoom on the picture from here then you can release it then it will turn into pen tool again so from here just click and click and from here you can uh, drag and hold drag and hold scroll down drag and hold scroll down drag and hold scroll down drag and hold then on the corner just drag and hold again then drag and hold drag and hold drag and hold drag and hold so just trace the image drag and hold and to finish the tracing when you see the circle beneath the pen tool just click it to close then right click then make selection just keep the default value then press ok now go to the move tool click it or by pressing V on your keyboard so from here just drag it going to the canvas so right now we'll just make some small uh, shadows go to window and layers so beneath it just click this new create a new layer then go to the tools click this elliptical marquee tool or by pressing M on your keyboard now just drag an ellipse below then you need to press D on your keyboard so that this uh, foreground color is black now go to edit go to fill 
change this one to foreground which is black then keep the values in the default then ok now go to select and deselect now we'll make some blur on the shadow go to filter blur and gaussian blur so we'll just adjust this one maybe 15 press ok now this layer 2 just drag it beneath the layer 1 so we have this we have this uh, shadow and click this one layer 2 and the opacity slide it on maybe 80 then we can move the shadow by clicking the move tool or you can use the arrow keys on the keyboard you can also resize the size of the shadow click the move tool this one then click this show transform controls then just drag this one here then you can click check you can click this check or press enter then it's finished we can now save it go to file go to export and save for the web so from here jpeg make it high and the quality is 60 you can adjust this one as you like maybe 70 is ok then click save so name, name the file uh, we put in amazon then save So right now, we'll open another document. So let's say this uh, lifestyle uh, image. So for this one, we'll check the size of the picture. So this one is big. It has 4,000 pixels by 29.55 pixels. So it's a... Uh, a high quality picture just click it ok now click the move tool and we will just drag this one maybe here so this product will just click this one here on the layers now we will just move it on the side we will uh, precise it you can hold the shift while dragging down maybe there then we can save it again export save for the web the same settings just save save then name it lifestyle so also we can also save this photoshop file file save as so we can name it uh, way protein then the file save file type as is photoshop just click it then save and there you have it you have your lifestyle images so here it is so this is the picture we have edited and the main picture thank you for watching